Hi everyone and uh, welcome back. In the previous videos we talked about use effect hook and I hope now use effect hook is clear to everyone. In this video we will just talk about one simple example. What other things we can manage with use effect hook like uh, uh, if you are using use effect hook to make an API call then we can manage the state of uh, this API call succeeded, failed, uh, data is loading, data has come, now show the data. Before that data is coming, we can show some kind of a progress, right? So for that also we can have a, some kind of a state and based on the logic we are writing inside use effect hook, we can decide when to mark that state as a loading, success, false, error, all these things. So I have these two different state, loading and as a boolean and error as a empty string I mean it can be some kind of error string which you are going to receive right so we are making call axios.get if we are getting data then we are setting that directly into the country so we are not we are using axios you can use fetch axios request any module okay dot then we are setting the countries and here we are doing set load as a true that means now we have the data we can show it on the UI but before that we were not having data so initially the the load state is false if the load state is false then we will be showing the loading behavior on the ui if we got the if we don't have any error if we got the loading stated as a true that means we got the data and we don't have any error message so here if set load is true but we got the error message then we have to show it so it just uh, it's just about how we can maintain these different ui state where data is getting loaded api is getting made api is uh, i mean we have uh, fired api call but there is a failure so we have to show the error message api is being fired so that is in progress that is in flight so we have to show progress message on the screen okay that api is being made so if you see uh, how it is working is loading right then we have the data so what if like if you just make some uh, error while making an API call it will go to the sketch you will set some error message and set load is true then this particular logic will execute and you will get appropriate message okay this is about how we can use use state and use effect hook together to manage the different state of the UI either while making a call or either subscribing and subscribing to a particular services particular channel okay Next videos we will talk more about use effect hook, what other things are possible, how we can write complex application, how we can simplify it, simplify it because use effect hook is actually doing a lot of things for us. Whatever we were doing earlier with the component did mount and component did update, all those things are being done with the single use effect hook for a functional components.